right, so this week I have my Windbreaker haul, which I've been waiting to do since last year, since I started collecting these. No lawn talking, let's go. So we'll start with my old crap. I'm doing this video for the second time because my battery died. So we'll start with old crap. I'm gonna try to keep this moving quick and quick and fast. This is one of my, this is my first, no, that's my second. Start with my first. This is my first Windbreaker ever. And it's the real, you see the sign, Windbreaker. And it's this one. I got this from Fur 21 two years ago for $10 in the sale apartment. It was in women's, but it's actually men's. And it's this like baseball style jacket. And um, it's a large, but I have other like smalls and extra smalls that are just as long. So their sizing is weird. But why I like this one, you see, because it has like the sweater material inside I actually can wear this to early fall with a sweater under or a thermal t-shirt so I that's why I really do love this one and because the price it was ten dollars so it's so my first but it's my favorite and it's close to my fourth so let's get moving my second favorite which is probably my top top favorite other than my new ones like this is my like my house is on fire I I'm grabbing this one so one of my only coats I'm grabbing to bring so it's this one, it's also a men's. They make something like this every year. Like they have something like this on the website right now. However, I don't know what kind of material last year's one. It looked like this, like the big po kangaroo pocket, but it was like khaki material. You couldn't see that on the website, but I saw it in store because I wanted to buy it. So this one is the Swishy Swishy 2. Um, I would say this one is not as good as that one. That one really repels the water, this one. I would say after 20 minutes, you get wet, but not wet to where your shirt get wet. And I feel like it's because of the mesh. So that's what I feel like this one makes this one very authentic. And also why I love it, it like buttons up so it has like a high neck effect. Then you have the big, I don't know if you guys can see, kangaroo pouch. I want to put something here because it never stays closed. Like a piece of like maybe um, Velcro. And then we have two pockets at the side and it also has this like it's like a fake hunting jacket to keep you breezy but it doesn't stay open so I don't even use it that mesh but yeah this is one of my favorites and this I believe in the store it was like extra 20 off like clearance so this was like I feel like 25 20 either 23 99 or 26 I got this for I remember under 20 or like 18.99 then with tax it was 20 bucks so those both are from 2007 Bruh. I just like them as jackets. I didn't know windbreakers were coming back. And that's why I'm doing this haul. Because when I was younger, like in the 90s, my mom, when chunky shoes were in and I was a little kid, I remember always wearing, if not windbreaker pants, a matching suit. And I remember too, like, older people. Like, I remember grandmas and, like, you know, those, like, jazzercise girls. Like, everyone just wore a damn matching track suit. Whether you had your little body suit and tights under, or this was just this and a t-shirt. This was the style. So I'm bringing it back. So we'll get to, that was 2017, we'll get to 2018. 2018, all these are not on hangers because I showed them, but if you guys watch my Forever 21 haul, I'll show a picture of it. I have two bags. The only thing is because this jacket was on and was open, because the bags were yellow against it and had a white t-shirt, in the thumbnail you can't tell that I'm wearing this jacket, but I am, and it's nice. The only thing I would say the mesh should have been throughout because the mesh is not everywhere in summer because that's when I did buy it and I did wear it like twice. You do get hot. The mesh in the inside does keep you cooler, believe it or not. And um, I don't like the mesh because the mesh, this is the pocket. So you can't like, don't put a pen and don't put your keys. I'm always conscious of what I put in my pocket. But I love it. It has the reflective stripe here and here and some writing sport femme. But why I like it, it gives you that like crossing guard chic, you know what I mean? And this also was a random, I just went in the store to pick up my package because that's where I pick it up to avoid shipping with my cheap self. And I just happened to, I always just browse through sale and I just saw it and I'm like, and I wanted the biggest because my size, I could tell it's kind of built wide and boxy because it's a girl's item. So I wish it hung a bit longer, but I believe it was 12 bucks for 12 bucks. You can't go wrong. So yeah. I'll post a video if you want to watch it because but I think that was the most interesting item actually out of that haul.
Like, first of all, that that dance, like, no offense, that looks like shit Kramer does. And I feel like I randomly talk and do that, but now it's a dance. Anyway, my last one, this one I bought last year when I had one pair of windbreaker pants and I kind of felt like, oh, I was actually going to do a sporty haul. That's where, I, if you watch my graphic tees, the Mike Tyson and certain of my sporty shirts were in there and like, I got some Nike stuff that I still didn't show because I was just going to all show that together, but I felt like that kind of would have been boring. So I split it up, did graphic tees, and then now I'm doing my windbreakers because I have so many now, finally. And now this one, it's also that dad jacket style, but this one is more silk. So with rain, mm, don't wear this on a rainy day. I did once by accident because I didn't know. And immediately, couple, couple, one, two rain licked, it penetrated right away. But this one with like a white t-shirt jeans, or I've worn it with like joggers, white t-shirt, and black and white sneakers, this jacket slaps and pops and looks so good. Like, I got to do some Instagram pictures with this. This is one of my favorites. This is currently on Forever 21. First of all, every jacket was Forever 21, other than the yellow one. All of the other two were men's. The yellow one was women's activewear jacket as well. This is Forever 21 men's. They still have this. This comes in red as well. The red, I believe, they still have up until extra large in sizing. But this sexy mofo, this, I think they only have to medium. But I will say, I bought extra small in this. This is as long as my red Forever 21, and that one is large. So I feel like they're making their sizes bigger, or at least this jacket. But what drew me to this jacket is, don't you, oh my god, like a slimesicle. Like, if you guys watch and you know, uh, neon green or neon yellow, both of them are my favorite neon colors. So just seeing that, and it, like he like with the he just looks slimy. I was like, no, 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 I gotta get it. And I just discovered this this year, because I actually bought this last year, October, when I bought all those t-shirts. I discovered this because I, I saw writing but I just didn't care because I bought it for the slime guy but I guess if you like it but this isn't sewn on it's like the sticker silk print I guess the M's I guess the millions but don't really care for that but yeah it has this uh you know the athletic piping throughout and uh yeah just the plain like push pockets but then why I do like it love a jacket with an inside pocket that's why when this one didn't come with it or the yellow one i was like that's kind of weak because the red one does have it as well i guess maybe the coach style has it but one of my favorites and i like i said i think 20 bucks i got that for yes because it's currently online for 26.99 and i got it when i got 40 percent off coupon so back where we were when i found out it wasn't taping i started to introduce the pants which are the most important parts because like you can wear like a track jacket. It's the pants that makes the outfit. And especially for dad sneakers, you don't need the jacket. If you just have a nice windbreaker pant and a t-shirt or a belly top and your chunky trainers or sneakers, you're, you're lit, you're lit. So we'll go to the ones you've probably seen. I also showed these in my like lime green, slime green haul. And these are from Boohoo. These are just my correct size size eight which i am not a two but these i would say like i can't wear these high-waisted they they kind of fall down they're not tight enough for me up there and i realized because i don't have like wide hips they just kind of look baggy and funny so i'm gonna wear these like low low on your hip like a leah style like back in like early 2000s how everyone wore their jeans that's how these are gonna fit me but i love the color like I love this because on online it did look bright as this, but this is a more subtle green. You know what I mean? This, I feel like, especially like I'm wearing like washed out gray um, joggers, this goes more with gray, with uh, like, I feel like with the jeans. This, more because it's bright, I'm going to wear like just white with it, I feel like, because it's so bright. But yeah, it has just a zipper on the edit plane. And these ones, I feel like I can wear now. But once summer comes, if it's not nighttime, I can't wear these. Because they don't have a lining. So, I don't know if you guys know about real Windbreaker. If they don't have that mesh lining or even just a thin cloth, like uh, cotton t-shirt material, you sweat in this crap. You sweat. 
like they're windbreakers but also sweat makers so i know yeah this is more if i do wear them nighttime but i really want to pair these with a white lace bodysuit so that's why i want to get one one of those ones that you know everyone has from pretty little thing and they have an electric green now yeah picture one of those it has like the kind of bus i think it has a cup or no but it has such nice etching and this thin spaghetti strap with this my chunky white feelers or these other chunky sneakers I'm going to get because those sneakers have a little blue in them. So it would really pop against those. Another pant I've had from last year, but I feel like I didn't really show because when I first had them, no one did, but now everyone does. And uh, I don't know if they're showing against the light, but they're the reflective pants. I've taken some pictures, which I never posted on Instagram because... Um, well, I'm going to post it because I like it because the pants are shining, but I'm darkened out because I don't know, like, it messes with the camera. But um, my hair could have been better. It was with my wig and I feel like I didn't color it yet properly, so it was really dark and it washed me out, but whatever. I got these from AliExpress, I believe for 12 because enough people wanted like 24, this, that, this, that. And I'm like, this is, I'm not buying it from Pretty Little Things, so I'm going to get the cheapest price. But yeah, they're the uh, reflection pants. Of course, AliExpress, they're cheap. They came with, you know, a lining. Um, this vendor, I bought them from... Oh, I didn't realize that. Oh, no, it's fake. No, fake back pocket. This vendor I bought from, um, I'll put the name up if you want. They do sell small, uh, medium, and large. I got small because when I looked at the people, it seemed to be real. I didn't have to get a bigger size. And they do fit me. They're not too big and they're not tight. So, yeah, if you like these ones, I could put up there they are. Oh, shit. Excuse me. I lied. I got medium. So maybe I was scared. But a lot of people who sell these only sell them in one size. That's why I did like this retailer because I, you can get any size. But, yeah, they're just the reflective pants. Everyone has them. PLT actually has reflective booties. I really like them. I might get them. But yeah, these are to be worn now too before it gets sweaty. Okay, last two pairs and these are my favorite. These I've been wanting for a while. The price just wasn't right. And these, I just randomly saw them so I bought them. And I will get another. I'm actually waiting for my other pair. They haven't come yet. So, ooh, I never even opened these. They have no lining because they're from AliExpress. I believe the other ones came with this brand, and I've got something else from this full sexy lounge brand from AliExpress. But these I got from my one of my favorite uh, sellers, Hey Young Girl, or or Sexy Mara is another seller of mine who has these. And uh, ooh, they have pockets, which I don't remember seeing, but that's cool. But also these, well, I bought them from my seller. You can get sizes, as you saw. I got small. And, oh, I didn't notice this either. But see, this is how the boohoo was supposed to be. In the 90s, I remember like the teenagers. I never unzipped mine because I was a kid and I just like how it looks like bunched at your ankle than your big sneaker. But this is how the teenagers wore them. They wore them open and then they covered your sneaker. So say you're wearing like a high top basketball sneaker. It would cover the top, then you'd only see the bottom. So these are real. The zipper opens for real, no webbing. But why I liked these, the um, the blue and the orange. When I was younger, um, my cousin gave me a hand-me-down Knicks jersey. And because I guess New York is so close to Toronto and because my grandpa lives in New York, I was just a Knicks fan when I was younger. Also Georgetown. So And my cousin gave me a Syracuse jacket. So just Syracuse, Knicks, George, any East Coast like big basketball teams or were my things so that's why you know what i mean so it's like say i get a nyx t-shirt or i've seen even on nikes i've seen the 270s have this colorway but i'm not that matchy matchy if i wanted to nyx shirt if anything i probably just wear them with a white t-shirt tied up or white tank top chunky white sneakers and i'd probably wear um orange lipstick and then call it a date or maybe tupac style a little folded orange bandana call it a date but I love these. And these were only, I believe, like $21. So other than these being the cheapest and these were all plastic, these were, I think, 20 bucks. But now Boohoo's back to 50 off. So these are like $28. But when I got them, I paid 20 So technically, you know what I mean? For actual windbreaker material, but it's a real pant. And it's good quality AliExpress. These, 
these are pretty good for 20 bucks yeah so the next color i'm getting i'm waiting on and it's almost been like the um time is running out so that's why i get i'm going to dispute it i believe i got it's blue here but this part's purple so if you like blue with purple the seller of these is hey young girl just put hey young girl pants hey young girl top they'll pop up you click on an item and just go to seller and you'll find both of these and i think sexy mara and sexy is spelled s-e-x-e M-A-R-A. -A. It's another brand that I buy from a lot who has similar things to Hey Young Girl. Sometimes cheaper or with no shipping. And for my last ones, these ones actually come with a matching jacket I may get. It's just the colors in it are not really my swag. So the last ones are from Forever 21. They're just not a Forever 21 item. This is one of the ones, like, if it wasn't on sale, this was online only. So I would have to return it online, not to store and it's from a company one oh there we go brand is one clothing uh what's it called la this is not periwinkle and i don't know if you can see 35 canadian the jacket is also 35 but it may be on sale i may get it after this i i didn't try them on or anything like i tried on the reflective and the yellow so i know but if they're good i'll probably get the jacket to have at least one full cohesive suit but they're these and i wanted them for so long it says periwinkle which i love but they they're great they're great like exactly that's great they don't look like blue but they're these the only reason like i said i didn't buy the jacket because i actually got these on sale when forever 21 had online items only no i'm lying because that would have brought them to 17. I got them cheaper than that. They had marked these down to like maybe 23 and I got 30 or 40 off because I actually got these for $13. So that's why I need to, I feel like the jacket's not on sale. It was only the pants. But I got small because the girl is thin and she looked like it was my same size. Bunching at the end. Back to my point. The only reason I didn't order the jacket when I, like I probably could have because they've had online only sales. The, you see how it's mostly gray, the pant? The jacket is mostly pink. Like, the jacket is reverse. It's mostly pink, and then on the arm here, it has the purple and this gray color. So it's like, it's pink. And the only thing I like about the jacket, it's cropped. It, like, it, like, stays here. It has something to hold it, but even if you let it down, it's not a long, it's like this long. It's not a long jacket. So it's kind of cute still. So I'll think about it. I'll think about it. But yeah, they're these. And then the stripe also continues to the back. But these, that's why I bought them. These really have the like 80s, 90s, like your grandma aerobics, you know, workout girl look. So, you know, these are really ones I've been dying to have, dying to wear. They've been in my cart since like the end of summer is when these came out, like September last year. And they finally put them on sale in January this year. And I caught them up first thing. Oh, oh my God only ones with no pockets only ones that's crazy aliexpress has pockets these don't but yeah they're these they're my babies so yeah that concludes the video um i hope you guys like windbreakers as much as me because yeah summertime like i said if i didn't tell you earlier i'm doing very casual you might see dresses i don't think i'm wearing them i'm just buying them i'm just i'm just doing this all summer i like it it feels good and i like it I'll see you next week.